Okay, Monica, thanks a lot. Sorry. Betsy is here now, and my friend, I understand that some changes are on the way, or at least some active stuff coming they, our way. They definitely are. I just want to say, Monica, if you still have your earpiece in, please ask the doctor to stick around. I want to ask him how my children cannot, like, kill each other. <laughs> because it's getting so, like, everybody's on top of everybody. We need stress release, right? Well, the rain is going to be coming down across all of northern Ohio tonight. So, you know, maybe now is the time to build your own rain gauge. Tonight on my Facebook page, I'm going to put out how to make a rain gauge. You never know. Maybe we'll inspire some new meteorologists out there. But the temperatures are going to be going up, not down tonight. That's a sign that things are a little different. And as the temperatures go up, look at the thunderstorm chances that come in. So we can turn this into a big old learning experience, too, because there's three ingredients to thunderstorms, everybody. Heat, humidity, and energy. You need something to get them going and that is all coming together as we head through the night. Rain is coming down now across a good part of Northeast Ohio. Uh, as you can see here, we do have the heavier showers that are uh, along a line from out around Avon, Avon Lake, Sheffield, Sheffield Lake, Sheffield Village, and then right down through Akron and down toward ports, uh, parts around uh, Uniontown and uh, areas around there. So we do have those rain showers coming in. There is more to the west that will spread across Northeast Ohio and there's also some potent thunderstorms that are firing right now back here in the plain states also farther to the south and then it's a blizzard that's on the backside so you know there's cold air and that cold air gets here tomorrow afternoon in advance of that though we got a whole lot of energy that's coming together all of this continues to slide to the east so that would put us in line for the possibility of strong maybe severe storms tonight and especially early tomorrow before it all begins to clear out Let's take a look at your national dine mart hour by hour forecast by midnight we're still dealing with scattered showers and storms. Look at the temperatures taking off. We're going to be in the low and mid 60s to begin the day tomorrow with scattered showers. Thunderstorm chances coming through right as the cold front comes in. Look at the temperature difference. Dover to Sandusky is pretty significant and then temperatures will dive. We'll be in the 40s by the end of the day. Here's your universal windows direct forecast 60s and falling. So, you know, keep an eye on the radar tomorrow uh, and temperatures only stay in the 30s on Saturday. Mid 40s then for Sunday and we have a slow climb that's coming as we head through next week with a few shower chances here and there. We'll be right back.